Welcome back, everyone, to Random Stupid Shit with Ken Snow and Shell. Yeah. Hey, Shell, how are you this evening? Shell, yeah, I'm doing great. All Beautiful right. Beautiful day. Sun is out. Yeah, awesome. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hey, first thing I'm going to hit you with tonight is some numbers. We, uh, we have huh? we have ninety eight percent of our listeners are in the United States. Where's our others from? Switzerland. <laughs> Whoa! Believe it or not, we it's got probably- people in Switzerland listening to us now. How this happens, I have no idea. I don't know anybody in Switzerland. I hope it's that band Crocus. You remember? It, it could be. It could be yeah. screaming in the night. Yeah, the band Crocus. That- if that could be there. Let's put it out there. If you're listening to us in Switzerland or any other country, give us a comment. Send me an email, kinsnowstudio at gmail.com. Send me an email. Right. Make us a comment. Let us know. Hey, if y'all got some stupid shit over in Switzerland y'all want to talk about, let's talk about it. I think that'd be fun. Oh, I know there's something stupid. There. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm sure there <laughs> is. Now, domestically, let's let's go ahead. Since we brought up 98% of our listeners are from the United States, of course, 55% are from Kentucky. Hmm. I don't go know figure. anybody there. Huh? I, don't, I don't know anybody <laughs> I don't know anybody there either, but they play uh, basketball and front horses and drink bourbon. Is that it? That's okay. it. That's all they do. Nine percent are from Alabama. Now I don't know uh, any. I don't I know. know what, that, that's that's Charles Barkley. I oh yeah, there we go. But hey, but, Charles. but Charles is an Auburn uh, alumni. I'm sure. I don't yes, know. Yes. You know, but he's in Alabama. Yeah, but he he might like not like the cats. You know, being. Oh, I don't. No, he I, likes Calipari. Yeah, well, yeah, maybe he does. But anyway, yeah, nine yeah. percent are from Alabama. Seven percent huh. are from Tennessee. Wow. And then we got five percent in Texas. Now I do know somebody in Texas, so that might be uh, that might be where where that's coming from. But I want to know. <laughs> I, I got a funny Texas story, real quick. Go ahead, lay it on. Okay, Elon Musk last night on Twitter. He said that he was going to start a college because he moved to Texas. And he said he's going to the Texas Institute of Technology. And then he comes back and he says, and social studies, social sciences. And he said it's going to be the University of Tits and Ass, the initials. (laughs) (laughs) TNA. T-I-T-A-S-S, it's an S. He's like, I'm like, oh, ain't nobody got to go to school. I just sell all the jerseys. <laughs> everybody <laughs> want to go to University of Tits and S. <laughs> I wouldn't mind going to the University of Tits funny. and S. I mean, what what high school kid would not want to go to the University of Tits and S? I mean, I don't know. Right. <laughs> uh, just, but here, here's here's what I want to know. Back to those numbers. Here's what I know. I want to know. Who? in Massachusetts would listen to us. <laughs> really? You're listening to us? Massachusetts? Yeah, and they are they're even in Methune, Massachusetts. I don't even know where Methune yeah. is. But I will I say can't. Methune has a pretty awesome looking waterfall little area. I, I think it's right in their downtown area. Very pretty place. But well, yeah, you know how I feel about rocks. <laughs> yeah, but Methune, Massachusetts. Somebody's listening to us in Methune, Massachusetts. All right, that's good. that's good. In Alabama, they're in Birmingham. Birmingham. I don't know. They anybody. love the governor. <laughs> I don't know anybody in Birmingham. <laughs> I don't. I don't think uh, I do. Do I know anybody in Birmingham? I'm just about. singing Skinner in my head now. <laughs> Memphis, Tennessee. Well. Uh, yeah, Kid Rock. That could be Kid Rock. That probably is yeah. Kid Rock. I bet he would like our show. Cause he's my he, animal spirit. He's probably got some random stupid shit he can talk about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh uh, well, the the guy I know that lives in Texas, he lives in Dallas. Well, it's San hey, An- this one from? San Antonio. I'm gonna have to get on him, man. You ain't listening to my podcast. Come on, man. Come on. Well, why he's man. like that? We went to all the concerts man. for Kid Rock, but I know that other guy, what, and he like your best man or something? Yeah. What's up with that? I threw up on him yeah, the night before the wedding. Well, what, yeah, kind of, yeah. what kind of shit is that, man? You can't follow my podcast, dude. Come on, brother. Man. There's shit. no loyalty. There's man. no loyalty. 
I, I tell you what, you'd listen to his, wouldn't you? Yes, I mean, I, at least absolutely one. I would. I would listen to his. If he was doing a podcast, I'd listen to every episode. I absolutely would. If somebody, yeah. if somebody I knew other than the Kelsey brothers, you know, I like the Kelsey brothers and I like their, their, yeah. their podcast, but the mm-hmm. one thing I cannot stand is an hour and a half. I mean, I mean, yeah, really? that's, that's a little long. That's I'm like, a little long. I'm like, come on, man. That's enough. I'm done with you guys. I have to turn them off about I, an hour in half hour in. Yeah. Yeah. I like that guy named Gator. He's from Florida, and he just makes little videos of going around the house on how to fix stuff. Gator's <laughs> cool. <laughs> <laughs> There's all kind of podcasts. I don't care. Yeah, I follow I, Gator and Kid Rock. That's it. <laughs> yeah, I don't care what you're into. I, I, it doesn't matter. There's a podcast for you. Yeah, which I is a good, which is a good thing. Way. But it also, it, it could it could be a rabbit hole. Oh, it can. They got out those new Apple glasses today, or this week and these people are actually walking around with these glasses and this one guy's in a Dunkin Donut and he shows what he's seeing is a butterfly eating his donut with him and he's standing there all goofy (laughs) I was crying these people are going to get robbed they're going to get knocked out and they're going to lose their $4,000 pair of goggles (laughs) they're ignorant (laughs) I saw the I think it was a commercial about them but I really hadn't seen anything else about them we eating out the gene pool. Stupid people like that, they deserve it. <laughs> Just like that movie Surrogates. Bam. Everybody going to be in the room, and there you go. Going to be who it's going to be. That's right. Not so, your day. what is the yes. subject for tonight's episode? I thought something a little bit lighter. Yeah? Um, let's go with some pickup. All right. Great All right. pickup lines. <laughs> let's do some pickup lines. All yeah, right. I, I bartended for a while. I've heard some good ones. <laughs> okay, well, throw one out at me. Let's do this one here. I had a really bad day. I need some moral support without the M. Oh, <laughs> that one was awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> oh, man. Wow. <laughs> well, hey, let me, right. let me, let me throw one out for you then. Have you used this before? Did you pick no. up your wife with this line? No, I did not. I have never used okay. this before. Well, here I am. What are your other two wishes? <laughs> That's pretty good. Yeah, man, That's well, pretty yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, your turn. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, Brit. All right. You want a Australian kiss? It's kind of like a French kiss, but down under. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Are you for real, man? What? It's me. What is the, what is the deal here? What? Boy, I tell you what. Uh, uh, I, all right, turn. all right. My turn. Is your license expired? Because you're driving all these guys crazy. Yeah, so you'll laugh on this one. All right, all right. All right. Will you turn the seat warmers on? I want to warm up your dinner. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> what is going on here? Nobody, <laughs> studio audience, what's the problem here? Y'all, y'all not liking hers? What, what's up with that? I don't get it. I mean, I, I don't understand. I hurt my feelings, and I'm going to take a shot of bourbon every time I hear a cricket. <laughs> they, they, they pretty cold over here this evening, boy, I tell you. Yeah, they are. Damn. All right. Here we go. My turn. All right. Your parents name you Google because you're everything I'm looking for. Wow. That was that was not bad. I see I would use that. <laughs> wow. Apparently they didn't like that one either. They're getting well, tough they get tough on me now. That's bullshit. You got a mirror in your pocket? Because I see me in your pants. <laughs> oh, I actually kind of like that one. That was my Yeah, y'all, y'all like, y'all like that too? Yeah. All right. Studio audience like that one too. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right, here we go. Right. Here's here's mine. Okay. This is kind of a long one, so. My buddies bet Everybody me that great. I couldn't have a conversation with the most beautiful girl in here. How are we going to spend their money? 
<laughs> wow. I mean, y'all are cold. Cold as ice. <laughs> I'm going to get a laugh now. Hold up. Let me pick a good one here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. All right. You plan on uh, giving me some more jewelry, or are you just going to use your hands to choke me this week? <laughs> That's for my Valentine. I don't, I don't know if that was really necessarily a good pickup line, but that was pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right. Here we go. Mine. Here, I got it. I got it. This is a good one. All right. Here we go. Let's get serious. I'm good at algebra. I can put shit. I know I'm fucked up. <laughs> Let me try. Let me get a do over. Get a mulligan. Give me a mulligan. <laughs> she, done lost the girl <laughs> she walked away. She done walked away. All right. All right. Let me try. I'm good at algebra. I can replace your X. You wouldn't even need to figure out the Y. Wow. <laughs> Well, yeah. Okay. Well, I kind of sucked on the first time, but you know, the second time wasn't so bad. That ain't too bad. That ain't too bad. You're like fine art, you know, the don't touch and everything, but I just want to grab you, push you against the wall, and nail you to it. Bam. Nail it in there. <laughs> nail nail <ya>. it. <laughs> Maybe All we right, should sure. call up Mr. Yeti and have him uh, see if he wants to. <laughs> I know what he would say. You want me to tell you? He'd what would say, he? have you ever been met with a wet willy? And then you go, hi, I'm Willie. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see. Hey, you know, uh, well, hold on. Uh, Mr. Yeti, are you here? Yeah. Hello. How's it going tonight? Well, hey, Mr. Yeti, what's up? Go ahead and uh, tell. Uh, I'm so excited he called. Yeah. So so do you have any uh, do you have any pickup lines? No. So yeah, use the one I had. So I'm all good. I'm gonna go back in the hood now. All right. We'll, well see I'll you later, Mister. more. I'll give you a few more, Mister Yeti. You'll be picking them up before you know it. All okay. right. All right. He's gonna hang out and listen. Okay. Yeah. You just sit right over there. Yeah. He's got. It. Okay. Go ahead. I'm glad he is he on Facebook or anything. Can I follow him? No, no, he's you know he's he's good at hiding. Asking, does a bear shit in the woods? I really want to know. <laughs> does a does a bear shit in the woods, Mister Yeti? Oh well, yeah. Where else are they going to shit? I guess they do. <laughs> I guess at that Mister Yeti, I tell you, he's what. a he's a funny guy. But anyway, all right. What's your next pickup line you got? Okay. You're like a balloon. I just want to blow you until you burst. <laughs> oh, Mr. <laughs> Yeti chuckled, didn't he? <laughs> I, no, I don't think he did. He didn't think I was uh, He probably on. didn't get it, the dumbass Yeti. <laughs> Could you get a Sasquatch? <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. He's, a, he's, a, yeah. he's not really a Sasquatch. He's a, he's a Bigfoot. Yeah. Oh, he's a Bigfoot? Yeah, he's not really he a Yeti. Goes he's, Mr. Yeti. He goes by Mr. Yeti because he wants to be a tough guy, but he's not really. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I got okay. You. All right. I got one right. last one. Okay. All right. Let's see. See if the audit studio audience is going to like this one. Are you alone because you have my interest? <laughs> I kind of like it. That's a whole play on words. I like it. Damn. I that, like that one. That was cold, right. brothers. Cold. Okay, that's all I had. That's that's all. I got there. a few more. Okay. I got a few more. All right, you bring them out. Come all on. Right. You're like Colgate. Nine out of ten dentists say I should be in your mouth. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. They like, oh, damn, they like that one. <laughs> wow. No. Emotional day. Can I use your <laughs> emotional support snake? Wow. Really? Yo. Okay. Yeah. They, they liking it. I don't know. There's, there's one more on there, and then I'm done. That's the last of them. It's like, can I change your face into a glazed donut? <laughs> really? Well, I tell oh, you. Man, like, wow, yeah. 
<laughs> they, they like your nose. That's that's pretty good. Huh? Kind of weird. I'm glad I don't face you face to face. I got my back to you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Kind of like, wow. Oh, okay. shit. That's funny. That's funny. I like that one. All right. <laughs> so, uh, so what else we got to talk about today? Are we going to try to uh, expand out a little bit from these pickup lines, or are we going to call it like this today? What are we doing? We're going to go from I'll pickup see. lines to dogs? Yeah, did you say, do you have anything else you want to talk about? I want to tell everybody that my dog is a real smart ass. I've got <laughs> to talk to him so much, and now I answer myself back, and I've made him such a smart ass that I don't even want to be around him, <laughs> and I, he follows me everywhere. <laughs> I don't um, think that's no. Well, I can say definitely that spring is coming because I have seen two skunks and almost ran over a possum. So spring is coming. Spring is definitely coming. Punks a deli, deadly feel, whoever the thing got it right this year. What do you want to talk to Mr. Yeti about? We can do that. He can come back since he's sitting in the studio with you. Well, he, yeah, he was sitting in here listening. Can I ask him if he's got a girlfriend and all that, or do, would you rather go somewhere else? I'll ask him if he's ever uh, drank well, a well, fine well, bourbon. <laughs> well, yeah, know. well, let's, let's, let's ask him. Let's see. Let's see if he knows so, anybody in Switzerland. So, uh, what's up, Shell? What, uh, what kind of questions do you have to ask me? I wanted to know if you knew or had any relatives in Switzerland. Uh, you know, I, I think I got some cousins that live over there. Uh, they, uh, uh, the Yeti group. You know, even though I go by Mr. Yeti, I'm actually a Bigfoot. I'm not a Yeti. But you know, they're cousins. Well, I think actually a Yeti is a put down for a Bigfoot, so I wouldn't call myself a Yeti. Well, it, it just kind of. You know, it sounded kind of cool, you know, and I thought, well, I'm going to be a Mr. Yeti. We can call you Richard is good, or? Yeah, I kind of like, I kind of like Richard, or or maybe Richard? we could call you, you know, we'll call Dick? you Dick. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> so, Tricky Dicky. <laughs> so, uh, you don't want me to come over and kick your ass, little man? Hey, hey, oh, no, <laughs> look, 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 look. You catch me, I'm fast. I, 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 I need to be safe here uh you know don't be threatening me you know in front of my studio yeah, audience he's trying to act like he probably really is a yeti because i think he's trying to make be all badass like a yeti that's all right i'm very sorry mr bigfoot okay. i will not make fun of you no more all right so what are the questions you have for me do you really throw rocks at people when they go camping yeah you know we just like playing around it's kind of fun. So, you know, we I thought I had. So I thought one time when I was in Bull Girl Scouts that something pissed on the side of my tent. Was that a Bigfoot? Well, it could have been. Uh, you know, it could have been a bear. It could have been a Bigfoot. We don't normally piss on tents because that kind of. Well, uh, yeah, a Bigfoot pissed on me when I was a kid. <laughs> uh, we just normally piss in the woods. But, yeah. You know, so you're telling me that, that all Bigfoots piss in the woods? Is that what you're telling me? Just like a, a bear shits in the woods? Oh, yeah. yeah. We always piss in the woods. We never. Did you, you marking territory? Yeah. Can y'all uh, devil marry? <laughs> no, no, no. We're monogamous. We have, a, okay. we have one spouse. I didn't know if you could double marry or not. <laughs> no, we have one spouse and we... Uh, uh, you know, we, uh, unless, if you if we don't get married, then there's a lot of people that get into porn. Uh, but I personally don't. Uh, I'm not into Do you that. know Anna L. Neal? <laughs> yeah. Do Anna L. <laughs> do, yeah, do you know her? Uh, no, no. I don't, I don't think he does. No. Maybe he does. I don't Sweet know. Sweet Virginia. <laughs> Sweet Virginia. No, I don't know. <laughs> Uh -uh. No, I don't know anybody like that. I don't even know so this fool. you haven't done the porn? Yet. No, I haven't. I don't even know this fool. I just come in and sit in with him every once in a while. I've listened to quite a few of your shows, but you yeah. know, I just don't like making attention. How old are you? Uh, let's see. I'm uh, 175, I think. Somewhere oh, there. wow. So are you interdimensional character? I mean, can you go in and out of wormholes and different dimensions? Uh, 
Well, yes, we, uh, we have the capability to travel in space and time. That's, uh, oh. that really is our secret. That's how we get away with it. Nobody ever finding us, because we, we could just disappear at any minute. Yeah, so, yeah, so you're able to time travel. No? Oh, no, no, no. It's not time no, travel. Different dimensions ain't time travel. That's just, yeah. that's something totally different. Right, yeah, it's not time travel. Well, okay. Well, that's that's kind of cool. And I never thought of that. That'd be cool, though. I'd be all like, "Do you got a telephone booth?" <laughs> I just have to ask one one question personally. Um, why do you stink so bad? Damn. Uh, well, he wipe you know, his ass in a force. You know, we got all this hair and we sweat, and actually, the scent is part of our camouflage because. People just think we're just any other wild animal out there. Oh, well. No, they think you're stink and they don't want to be around you. Well, it kind of... You probably have a lot of friends and the world would be a better place if you just drank a Coke and got along with people. Yeah, have a Let Coke and a smile. That. I mean, you know, it's, yeah. it's big deal. You're a fascinating character. There's so much stuff I want to ask you, but you're elusive. Yeah, well, go you're ahead elusive. go ahead and ask him some more questions, Shell, and see, uh, see if we can get it out of him. Come on, man. Go ahead, tell them. You like the rock? What kind of music you like? I like rock. Uh, rock? I, heavy I, metal? I like rock, and I like blues, and I, I like a, a you know, but I tell you, my favorite band is Air Supply. No way. Oh, yeah, I love Air Supply. Do you eat mushrooms out of the, in the world to <laughs> me. You're everything I need. Oh. You're everything to me. Oh my God! That's your he's, every big. Friend. He's breaking wow. out. He's breaking out an air supply song over here. What are you? Are you fucking kidding yeah. me? Good Lord! Good I, Lord. I'm traumatized <laughs> by air supply. My sisters <laughs> loved that, and I had to listen to it. And I was like, "Please, some Ozzy!" No, <laughs> and they no. wouldn't do it. No, I had to listen to that, and Tim or Tom Waits and Billy Idol. Still cannot listen to him. Uh, mm -hmm. Well, then again, isn't Billy Idol Bigfoot? No, Billy Idol is not a Bigfoot. He's a nymph. He's like like a little <laughs> hurt, like a gnome. Yeah, yeah, that's he, pretty, he, yeah I agree. That it is it's pretty funny. Yeah, Billy Idol is yeah. not a Bigfoot. No. Oh, my goodness. That is funny. He'd mm -hmm. be a Yeti if he was, did have big feet. I'm just saying. <laughs> that's right. He sure would. All right, so well, hey, we glad got, Mr. Yeti come and seen us tonight. Thanks. Well, uh, Mr. Yeti, do you have you get any? Used to the smell. Do you have? Yeah, <laughs> Mr. Yeti, do you have any parting words for us this evening? No, I ain't got nothing for you. Uh, I got one more question. Okay, what's what's your question? Does when the bear shits in the woods, does he wipe his ass with a rabbit? I've been told. You've been told. He sh Did you hear that? When a bear sits in the woods, does he wipe his ass with a rabbit? That would be a uh, yes. Why don't you? <laughs> uh, are you going to respond to that? Uh, well, you know, I, I, when I'm taking a shit personally, I ain't trying to hunt down no damn rabbit. Because when I take a shit, it's a lot. Do you got the fecal smear? <laughs> I actually think I do. <laughs> so, <laughs> so that's what it is. You, you got the to eat more fiber. You got the fecal smear. See, you need to stop he eating little animals. You made my drink. <laughs> <laughs> you, you need to stop eating little animals and start eating a little more grass. Some weeds. Yeah. Some plants. Yeah, you need some fiber. You need some fiber. Do y'all wait for the fruit to go bad so you... It, like make your own wine like they do in prison, but you do it out in the woods in a toilet. <laughs> no, we don't have to. You make we don't have to make it. We just wait till it gets old and you eat it and it ferments in your belly. Oh, oh. so you're out there drunk with the moose because moose get yeah, drunk every that, year. Exactly. Too. You're like a moose. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm feeling it's savage out there, isn't it? It's it's a cruel world out there. Bees do that too. They come home all drunk, can't get in their homes, and fly into the side of it. Yeah. 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 They couldn't get insurance if they were like humans. Bees wreck <laughs> all the time. I've seen two squirrels crash, but the bees are really bad. <laughs> all right, Mr. Yeti. Uh, so, 
Mr. Yeti, we're going to thank you for coming in tonight. We want to appreciate you stopping by, and we really appreciate you listening to the episodes. And uh, hey, all you people out there listening to your podcast, make sure to give us a follow, give us a comment, give us some, uh, give us some content. Tell us some stupid shit that you've experienced, and we'll talk about it. Uh, Ken Snow Studio at Gmail dot com, and uh, so Mr. Yeti, you have a good evening. Yes, yeah, Mr. Yeti, it was nice to meet you, and I hope to see you again soon. Thanks, I enjoyed it. All right, well, thank you, too, and uh, I might be back in, in other shows. We'll see how it goes. Uh, everybody out there, you have a good time. All right, thank you. Hey, that was, that was kind of cool having Mr. Yeti come in. Oh, hey, hey. the crowd liked him. Go, Mr. Yeti. Think- Go, Mr. Yeti. Can I take this time to invite Kid Rock? Yeah. Yeah. Talk to Kid Rock for a minute. Yeah, we got we got your bourbon you like. I can fry catfish, chicken, anything you want. Just sit around and talk. It'd be fun. I, I guarantee you he's got some random stupid shit stories. Guarantee. All right. Hey, Kid Rock, this is an offer out to you to come on the show, talk to us, tell us some stupid shit. But yeah, you know until the end, yeah, you, you know he does. But until then, hey, you got us a joke of the day? Nope. <laughs> 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 All right. Well, Not Shell, yet. Shell, uh, Shell's leaving us with no joke of the day today. So, but go ahead and and put them words on them. Tell them, tell them our closing words. You do you. Y'all have a great night. Thank you very much. Like she said, you do you, we'll do us, and we'll see you next week on Random Stupid Shit with Ken Snow and Shell Yeah.